We have just learned the identity of the man police say stabbed an older couple inside their Portsmouth home. He is 49-year-old James Artis Jr., the next-door neighbor. Well, the couple, a 64-year-old woman and a 74-year-old man, just returned from the hospital. Police say that shot artist is still in the hospital. Yeah, police say that the victims called 911 around 10 yesterday morning, saying they had been stabbed. When police arrived, they found the man bleeding and the woman hiding in the attic. I spoke with their nephews today. The boards and blood are a far cry from the normal welcome in this home. The Christmas, the Thanksgiving dinners, this, here it is, right here. Donald Hill cannot comprehend what his aunt and uncle, Joan and Sherman Mason, have been through. He told my uncle that, that he had his money and, and that was it. And then the guy just went off. And as soon as my uncle opened the door, just as soon as he opened the storm door, the guy just came in just never stopped stabbing him. The man, he says, lives right next door. Why he did it, we don't, we just don't know. We, we, I'm not, you know, holding nothing back. We don't know. You know, they don't know. They, they, they couldn't tell you this themselves. Hill and his brother came by to fix the door and grab some clothes for the couple. They're not sure if they'll be staying here when they get out of the hospital. My aunt is really, really shook. They are expected to make a full recovery, physically anyway. Emotionally, his aunt told him. It's like an out-of-body experience. That's Very close family. Artis is now charged with attempted capital murder of the police officer. Other charges, I'm told, will follow. Now, late this afternoon, I spoke with Artis's girlfriend on the phone, and she told me she has no idea what happened. She was not at home at the time. I asked her if he had ever used drugs or acted strangely, and she said no. I then asked about his condition, and she said she didn't know because she had not been to see him. A torch.